Loose City goalkeeper Kyle Morton has put in a lot of work off the pitch in the last couple of months. After going through concussion protocol, he saw action again in recent matches. Morton is taking a noticeable step, though, in making sure he stays safe. To get that game day buzz again was a really nice feeling. Loose City goalkeeper Kyle Morton is back. After suffering a head injury at Tampa in early June, he returned to the lineup in mid-July against Memphis and recorded a clean sheet on Wednesday against Phoenix. It took some time, but um, it actually allowed me to get into a nice little routine in that month and uh, get with the lens and get with the weight room and um, just kind of focus on some things I need to focus on within the month and uh, feel good now. Head coach Danny Cruz knows just how much work it takes to come back after dealing with a head injury. I've been through it a lot as a player. Um, I've had some really, really bad ones throughout my career. Um, and I've seen the effect they, that they can have on an individual. I've experienced it firsthand. That's why both Cruz and Morton continue to take Morton's injury seriously. In fact, fans have likely noticed Morton is wearing something that provides a bit more protection around his head, even though he doesn't have to wear it. For me, he can wear whatever he wants to wear. I, uh, um, I've made it very clear both to him, uh, to my staff, and obviously in the press as well. I don't uh, mess around with head injuries whatsoever. I will never push a player. I don't care how important the game is. Um, so if he feels safer uh, wearing it, then that's, that's great by me. Morton joked, though, he wishes the headgear was a bit cooler. I'm taking it off every now and again whenever I get a chance. Just the overheating is ridiculous. And, um, it's a little bit of protection, but it's also a nuisance at the same time. It sure doesn't seem to be affecting his play, though, at all.